G'day, I'm David G. Sheshnag Mandia. What on earth is Kundalini? That's a series available on Amazon. You can also join the Kundalini Awakening channel on Facebook or subscribe here. Just wanted to talk about the unconditional love dilemma. I see there's a fantasy going around to do with this unbelievable goal as a human to have unconditional love. Personally, I don't think it's possible. Of course, mine is just an opinion, like everyone else's opinion, and hopefully you find people that offer the same opinion as you so you can be comfortable with it, or one that you're uncomfortable with and you can work through to decide what opinion's best for you. I personally don't believe the unconditional love experience is available as a human. I believe that the experience of being pure awareness and total acceptance and allowance of other people's experience is possible. But love's become a commodity in this culture where it's utilised for emotional benefits or closeness or needs to be met if you understand what I mean when you say I love you like of course you can say I love you if you say I unconditionally love you that person who unconditionally loves you is going to be annoyed with you sooner or later it's just what I've noticed in life it's like impossible as an imperfect human To be in the state of mind where your heart's open all the time and you're in this totally accepting and loving experience. Maybe it is possible. Maybe my dad unconditionally loves me and doesn't offer a lot of advice and just sits there and listens. I imagine there's some things that I express that aren't his truth but he has a great ability to accept and allow me to be me. But in a relationship, I've found that love's love. And you love the whole person. You love every bit about them, you know. Um, Their values and beliefs, hopefully, with someone that has a compatible value and belief system... But to be able to sit there with maturity and be able to discuss differences, that's love. The unconditional part, I don't think it comes as being a human. I think being imperfect, we are bound to upset people. We are bound to have conditions, you know, if you know what I mean. I just don't think it's possible. Have you ever thought of an experience where unconditional love was prevalent in your life or where you can experience unconditional love? If you have children or family that you visit, then there's a big chance that the unconditional love gets tested. Is it something that's possible? I personally don't believe so. Are you allowed to step back from your needs being met or your beliefs being validated to be able to experience acceptance in the moment and make love to that moment and appreciate it for what is and then feel the feelings coursing through your body and allow that to happen without judgment, without shame, without desire to change it? Hmm. I hope so. Thanks for listening. Just a bit of a spiel on the unconditional love fiasco. I don't know if it's possible. I personally don't think unconditional love is possible. But maybe it is in your life. If so, write something in the comments. Tell me how wrong I am. Om Namah Shivaya Har Har Mahadev.